It is one of the rarest sightings in this part of the world, a Greenland shark in the Western Caribbean Sea. The Greenland shark is one of the largest cartilaginous fish with a body temperature of less than 35 degrees Fahrenheit, the same as the water it inhabits far north in the Arctic and North Atlantic Oceans. Back in May, Hector Martinez and a team of researchers with Moat Marine Laboratory and Aquarium were out at Glover's Reef conducting research when they caught a Greenland shark in a most unlikely environment. We went out on the east side of Glover's. Uh, we set the line down from Northeast Key. We went maybe half a mile out Northeast Key and went south, uh, southeast. Um, it got really windy, so we couldn't pull the line as often as we wanted. So we waited until morning, and when we went up to pull the line, the anchor that we had dropped, probably half a mile out Northeast Key, had swing all the way around to maybe two and a half mile, three miles from where we dropped it. So we're like, there has to be something big on that line to drag that thing far out. And the line's pretty long, so it's pretty heavy. Martinez and his crew spent the next two hours pulling the shark to surface. At first, the captain of the boat, Martinez's uncle, thought that they had captured an Atlantic six-scale shark, a more common sighting in these parts. When I first see, saw it coming up, I was controlling the hydraulic motor we used to pull the line and I looked down and the captain, my uncle, he's like, something's coming up. No one ever thought it was that. And I see it, it looks this big, like this long, but this wide. So I was like, what the hell is that? And as it kept coming closer up, it looked like a monster. I stepped back, like shit, is this thing gonna jump in the boat? <laughs> um, but when, once we floated up, uh, we saw what it was. We didn't think it was a Greenland shark. Without accurately identifying the shark, the team took a video and proceeded to release the beast. Through that video, Damien Chapman, the director of Sharks and Rays Conservation Research at Moat Marine Laboratory and Aquarium, identified the shark as a Greenland shark. It is the first time in the history that a Greenland shark has been found in the Western Caribbean Sea. Well, the Greenland shark belongs in Greenland. It has, it has that name for a reason, so it belongs in Greenland. I think it's up in Canada a lot. Um, so that, that is like the main amazing part. It doesn't belong in Belize, and also it's never been recording in Belize, recorded in Belize to my knowledge. Well, when we go out there, we're always curious to see what's coming up from the depths, and I hope to catch a white shark one of these days. <laughs> I don't know if that day will come, but I, you probably heard that they spotted um, orcas off of Rangwana Key several years back, right? So we definitely get some rare creatures out there. So yeah, there's definitely that hope of catching something even... Well, I don't know if we'll ever catch something rarer than that because that's very rare, but... It's like lottery, it, right? It's like lottery. It's like lottery. It's probably... You probably have a better chance winning the lottery. <laughs> Reporting for News 5, I am Paul Lopez.